extract DNA from an eye. So what do you need for this experiment? You need a measuring jug, you need washing up liquid, salt, surgical spirit, which you need to place in the freezer at least one hour before this experiment, a plate, and a bowl so we can squash the banana in, fork, knife and spoon, tweezers, three gloves, cups, small sieve, and the ripe banana. So the first step is to peel half of the banana, The right pair is better. Chop it up into small pieces. Place it in your bowl. Use the fork and mash it. This is going to be a bit fun, and some of you might not like it at the same time. So we're going to mash up the banana as much as possible. The next step is preparation of the extraction mixture. This is going to be prepared so that it will be added to the banana and the DNA can escape from the cells. For the extraction mixture, we need to add 90 milliliters of water. Tap water is okay, use a measuring jug and measure 90, 90 milliliters and place in the cup. Then add a teaspoon of salt. Teaspoon of salt. Add two teaspoons approximately of washing up liquid. So we need to stir gently so that no bubbles will start to form. Once that is done, add approximately four teaspoons of this extraction mixture into another cup and add your mashed banana. Placing the mashed banana first, and then I'm going to add and you mix again gently. Next step is sieving. We're going to sieve our mixture into a clean glass using the sieve. What we're doing now is we are removing the debris, so to say the plant material, the, bit, the bits and pieces of our banana which doesn't contain DNA because we have extracted the DNA using the table salt and the detergent. So we're filtering it and we're just going to keep the extract that is going to remove, which is passing through rather the sieve and forming below in the cup.
The last step is the extraction of the DNA. Now you need your surgical spirit, so you have to remove it from the freezer. Make sure it has been there for an hour or more. The more it is in there for, the better. So this is the cup with the banana extract from the previous step. You need your ice cold surgical spirit and start to pour it down the side of the glass very gently. Let it stand. As you can see, it's becoming cloudy. That indicates that the DNA is forming in the alcohol or in the surgical spirit. The basic surgical spirit, its basis is alcohol. And alcohol is causing this extraction. The reason is that alcohol makes the DNA clump together. So we can see. And eventually, hopefully, we'll be able to as well, pull it out using our tweezers. Good for a couple of minutes, five minutes at least, or more. And you will start seeing the DNA floating in the surgical spirit layer or the alcohol layer. I can pull it out. I can say DNA because it has clumps together because of the surgical spirit.